Today's tutorial, I am going to show you how to add a logo or image carousel onto your Divi theme website. So I'm just going to give you a little overview of what this looks like now. It is a logo carousel that I'm using on one of my um, website templates. And you can see you have the option of it automatically scrolling or you can have the arrow navigations as well. It's completely up to you if you choose to have that. So I'm going to show you exactly how to put this logo carousel or image carousel onto your WordPress website. So head over to your WordPress dashboard and then go to plugins and add new plugin. From here, I want you to search for the plugin called Divi Carousel Light. And this is the plugin that I'm using. It's called Divi Carousel Light Image and Carousel and Logo Carousel. It is completely free. You can just install that and then activate it. Then you can head over to your page that you want to add it into. I'm going to create a new row to insert this module into. So now if you type in logo, you'll see the logo carousel module that will come up. From here, it will automatically populate with um, some free logos. So you can just go through and delete them or you can replace it with your logos. A couple of other features to go through. So you've got the carousel settings general, so you can change up the animation spin, even turn off autoplay as well. And here is where you can decide what kind of navigation you want. So you can choose whether you want to have the arrows or you can choose. To. So here you can choose to have no navigation and it will just automatically slide if you've got that autoplay turned on. And it also comes with this nice hover feature. You can decide how many logos you want to show on desktop and then you also have the option of choosing on tablet and mobile as well. When you add in your logos you might find that they all align to the top so just make sure that when you're doing this to set the height to 100 pixels and you can also set the width if you want them to be smaller or bigger, you can play around and decide what kind of percentage width that you want them to be. The thing that you can do under the carousel settings is scroll down to um, slide spacing. And if you want them to be to have more spacing in between each logo, you can make this a higher number. Here on the design tab, you can go to carousel top spacing and add spacing at the top and the bottom. You can also, if you're using the navigation of the arrows, you can change the height, width and size of the icon and also the color of the icons as well. So if I turn that back on, I'm just going to turn the navigation of the arrows back on here. Go over to the design tab, go to navigation. And here I might just want to make the arrow sizing slightly smaller color of the icon and then I can also remove that uh, background gray background color. So you can really customize this logo carousel to exactly how you want it to be with your branding and it also gives you the same option for an image carousel as well. If you have any questions at all just pop them below in the comment section. So don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you get notified for all of my tutorials on Divi and Dubsado setup.